Hello everyone, today we will introduce to you the manual drawing of road facilities. In the road facilities panel, we can manually draw poles, power lines, draw traffic signs, parking spaces, sewer grates, manhole covers, etc. according to the built-in templates in the software. The first function is pole detection. The software provides four detection modes, which can quickly extract different pole targets and save the extracted models in the specified line layer. Street lights and utility poles can be detected and line layers can also be added through custom layers. Single point mode. Set the radius of a pole. Click on a point on it to detect vertically downwards. Then generate a pole vectorization and save it in the corresponding layer. Two point mode. Select the top and bottom of a pole as the key points. It can also generate the vectorization of the pole and save it to the corresponding layer. Polygon mode. Minimum height. The poles below the set height will not be extracted. Frame a certain range of point clouds containing poles, and multiple poles can be detected once framed. Grip ground mode. Set the height of the pole subsequently generated. Click any point on it and then click the ground point. It can automatically detect from the bottom to the top from the selected ground point and the bottom of the three-dimensional vector line of the pole detected in this mode is completely flush with the ground point. Power line detection. Click power line detection. Click the growth starting point of each power line. Right click to go back and double click on the starting point of the last power line to end. Then drag along the direction of the power line until all real-time vector lines are parallel to the point cloud of the power line. Left click to confirm the growth direction and then it will start to grow automatically. The result of the completed detection is shown in the figure. The function of adding traffic signs is to use templates to quickly extract signs, and the point cloud fitting function must be enabled before use. Select the circular and triangular signboards to be drawn. The graphics to be drawn will be displayed where the mouse is in real time. Right click to adjust the size and double click to confirm the current signboard. The shortcut key prompt is in the upper left corner of the window. We can use the shortcut key R slash T to rotate. Rectangular sign drawing. Click on the point cloud plane of the road sign to generate a fitting plane and then draw a rectangle on the plane by using the three-point frame drawing. Add parking spot. After clicking the three corner verticals of a single parking spot to determine a single parking spot, move the mouse to update and display the number of parking spots in real time. Check the fit between the template and the actual parking spot and double click to finish adding a parking spot. Adding a rain strain is similar to adding a manhole cover. Click to add a manhole cover, and the graphics to be drawn will be displayed where the mouse hovers in real time. Right click to adjust the size, and double click to confirm the current vector. We can use the shortcut key R slash T to rotate. The shortcut key prompt is in the upper left corner of the window, and the result is stored as polygons in the planar facilities layer. This is the end of the manual drawing introduction of road facilities. Thank you for watching.